Hey, Robert, just what's it been like, you know, finally getting the chance to get some on-field work in? Obviously, it's not a, a live setting necessarily, but, you know, you're you're finally getting those NFL reps and kind of getting a chance to get acclimated. What have these last two weeks been like for you? Uh, these last two weeks have been good, uh, you know, just building blocks day by day, uh, starting to get a feel for the game, uh, learning technique and getting transitioned down. So just getting a good feel and preparing myself for what's down the road. Gary. Hey, Robert. What, what's what been um, kind of the biggest transition for you? I mean, I know you're just getting started here, but but and a lot's coming at you quick. But is there anything that's kind of stood out in terms of the, the biggest challenge, you know, for you making this transition? Uh, Probably just uh, technique, just being more technical in areas that I wasn't in college, uh, just getting new steps down, new footwork, new new eye mechanics, just those type of things, just the transition for me, really. And uh, I think, you know, after the draft, uh, they talked quite a bit about just your versatility and I, I think maybe your ability to do a lot of different things, special teams and otherwise. I mean, how do you kind of uh, see your role evolving? Or I mean, what would be best case scenario for you as, as things evolve? Uh, just to get in there and get into a position to where I can help in any, any way that I can. Uh, yeah, I'm a special teams guy. I feel like I play anything, do anything. Uh, just just willing to win, willing to do the dirt, uh, the work, everything. So just being that type of guy, being ready uh, to play anything is always great. Thanks very much. Jordan? Hey, Robert. Um, on that note, I know you didn't play a ton of nickel in college, but is that something that is expected of you is to make sure that uh, you're kind of learning as much as you can, but hopefully not too much <laughs> all at once? Uh, just right now, just learn the whole defense as a whole, uh, just to be prepared for anything that is to come. Uh, so just trying to get all the positions down and know what the calls are and be able to communicate with everybody on the field uh, to put myself in a position that if I have to play in, anywhere else, I'll be ready. And right now, particularly because um, obviously these are voluntary sessions, um, it looks like you're getting a lot of work against some, uh, particularly some first team receivers. What is that like for you? Um, kind of just getting thrown right into it right away. And what kinds of things have you learned even in your short time so far? Uh, that's probably the best part about it, being thrown right in there, right in the mix. Uh, just being able to transition with the game and learn the speed of the game and seeing uh, guys full speed and the guys that, that do start and be, being able to just be there and go hand in hand with those guys is great. Uh, just taking advantage of each day. You know, we ain't got many practices left, so just taking advantage of that and just being grateful that I am thrown in there a lot and getting those reps is, is everything. Yeah, I was going to ask, is it, do you see it as like an opportunity? Because obviously when camp comes around and everybody's here, you know, maybe you'll be doing some different things. Um, so seizing that opportunity, was that a big motivator for you, especially knowing you were going to be thrown in with the ones at times? Most definitely. Most definitely seizing the opportunity because, you know, it could have been granted to someone else. Uh, they entrusted me to say that I could potentially be there and just being able to r rotate with guys and just to be able to get reps at practice in that position, you know, helps me out in all ways. And then, sorry, guys, last one from me. Um, I saw a note that you're the high, and please correct me if I'm wrong, um, highest drafted player ever out of Central Arkansas. Is that correct? Yes, yes, correct. Okay, what was that like for you? And who have you celebrated with so far? Uh, that was great. Uh, I celebrated with all all my teammates back at Central Arkansas. Uh, when I when I was drafted, I celebrated with all of those guys. Talked to all my coaches. Uh, gave thanks to everybody who helped me get here. Uh, so it was definitely a good moment, for real. Thanks, Robert. No problem. Kevin. Hi, Robert. Uh, coming in here, um, testing yourself against players at the next level. Does it teach you something about maybe what your strengths are and, you know, on the other hand, uh, the areas where you want to work uh, yeah. most specifically to improve? Yeah, definitely teaching me a lot. Uh, showed me full speed reps, uh, just transitioning in breaks and routes and coverage in my eyes. So it's definitely helping me uh, being in there and moving with those guys. So it's, it's helping me every way that it can. Uh, I don't look at it as, you know, like bad reps or none of that because it's me getting better, you know, it's me growing, me building myself up for other situations. So just taking it day by day. 
have there been moments where maybe there, you, you know, you, you you felt like a rep didn't go well? I, I yeah, that probably didn't happen a whole lot, you know, when you were uh, one of the top guys uh, at the at the last level. Um, uh, did, is that something you have to get used to again? Uh, yeah, I say all the time I've been here before, you know, starting over from just relearning different defenses in the scheme and what's really going on. Uh, so just being in this position is just taking the reps one rep at a time, you know, looking at what I did wrong and examining the rep. Yes, yeah, it's, it's always stuff I could do better. So just learn from what I could do better and what I did on that, that particular rep is all I really do. Thanks, Robert. Hey, we can wrap up with Stu. Hey, Robert, appreciate you uh, taking this question here. I was just curious about uh, what it's been like getting to know and, and getting to work with your uh, draft classmate, Bobby Brown. Sounds like you guys had a good time at the uh, SoFi Stadium tour recently, and he's a guy that's got, you know, a, a pretty big personality. What do, you, what do you like about working with him both on and off the field? Uh, yeah, that's a funny guy, man. A guy to make you laugh all day. Uh, big character, a uh, guy that loves this game just as much as me, so as a guy that I be with. On, on the field and off the field. So just having a guy around that's similar to me and characteristics, uh, you know, is everything. So we enjoy the game together. We live life outside of this together. So just having them around is, is great. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Are right, you all set? Thanks, my man. Thank you.